you're not the doctor, are you, man? I am not. Oh, all right then. I was gonna have to take a look at. I was gonna have you take a look at my balls, man. They're on fire for some reason, and I can't seem to put them out. David quietly snickers to himself. It's Snickers, by the way, not Snickers. Oops. Itchy ear, sorry. It's not Snickers. Snickers is a chocolate. It's Snickers. Sorry, can't help you there. Man, this game is dope. It certainly looks like it. On the table rests some sort of colourful game board with green leaves and cards all over it. My reefer reaper hits you for two. What? Not so fast. I'm going to cast my up in smoke guard and block the damage. Damn it. They're making this up as they go, aren't they? What, what are you guys playing? We're playing a new game that Vitium came up with called Marijuanic. Marijuac. Marijuagic. The smoking in. Magica the Awakening. Is that what that is? Marijuagic the Smoking. I think that is. That sounds an awful lot like a lame rip of a hit classic card game that already exists all around the world. No way, man. This is completely original. Hey, what are you guys playing, man? We're playing the card game you made, remember? No way, man. I made a card game. What is it called? Marijuagic, the smoking. I don't know, man. That sounds an awful like a pretty famous card game that's already played all around the world. The name kind of sucks too, man. I hate you so much, Vitium. So very, very much. Okay. I don't even know how much. We've got $350 now. Uh, buy... Still can't buy the revolver. Or the shotgun. Okay. Uh, okay. We'll leave it for now. Okay, let's go and see what these guys are doing down here. I wonder if I can teach my Care Bear how to use a slinky. I'm sure people would come far and wide to watch that spectacle. Yeah, not sure. The rain has passed. The sun is shining so naturally. The sinners are out bathing in it. More power to them, I say. They should get used to the heat where they're all going. Oh, I see. I see. Another hell joke. I told that idiot outside that he could catch golden fish off the dock if he used the right bait. He's been trying to figure out what the bait is all morning. There is no golden fish. That's actually pretty funny. There has got to be a gambling book around here somewhere. I need to get good and fast. The big game is tomorrow. Have you considered cheating? I'll take that as a no. I'm not safe. None of us are safe here. What's going on? I found one inside. Oh, the bees. One what? One of them. Look, there's nothing wrong with them. Just because they're a different colour than you, you really should be more accepting and open-minded. Well said. Well said. This is an educational game as well as an entertaining and funny game. What are you talking about? The girl in the room in chain, chains, I'm guessing. Wait, what are you talking about? She's talking about the bees. I, I, Even I got onto that. Come on, Richard. I found a bee inside. It was buzzing around the fireplace before it flew in. I haven't seen it since. I'm go... <clears throat> I'm not going to assume it's dead. That's what they want you to think. That's how they get you. Right, okay. So, what did you think I meant again? 
Nothing. Um, just bees. I agree with you. Bees are the devil. Bees, bees, bees. Always buzzing their evil little tunes in our ears. I'm so glad you agree. Richard, you are ridiculous sometimes. Richard lets out an exasperated sigh. <sighs> I know. Ten points, though. Not to be laughed or shouted or screamed at. Are we going? Oh, no, we're going back up that way, aren't we? To the Murgle Burgle. Do we do we go all the way up to the Mergle Burgle? I guess this is it. So it is. Would you like to save the game? Yes, please. Richard Longjong Long takes a deep breath inward before exhaling loudly. Nervous? It's just hard because I feel bad. I know what I must do. What I had to do next was not easy, not because Murgle was a worthy adversary, but because Murgle, by all rights, was in fact an innocent creature. Not making it any easier on me. Sorry. Are you? Are you really, though? Not even a little bit. Trust me, this is going to be really difficult in so many ways. Arsehole. Ah, oh, so you've come back for more, huh? Murgle, please don't make this any harder than it has to be. You dare threaten the almighty, Murgle. You will rule the day. Rue the day, not rule. Rule's a silly word. It doesn't make any sense if you say rule the day. Rue the day. Murgle will slay thee for gr the great Murgle Burgle clan. Very well then, let's get on with it. I'm going to get beaten up now, aren't I? He's huge, and quite scary, actually. You've been warned. Prepare to meet your doom, traveller. You don't have to do this, Murgle. For the Murgle Burgle clan! Right, let's go... Actually, should we poison him first? Because we've got another big sloppy eggplant, haven't we? Murgle is poisoned. Unlucky Murgle. Okay, we can't use multi shot yet. Pew! And I missed. This is why you need more than one shot. Ah! That looked like it hurt. I'm fine. Sure you are. Sixty. He's he's got loads of health. Can, I, I don't think we're ready to do this yet. And we can't even escape, can we? We have to fight. Oh dear. This is going to be long. Pew, pew, pew. That was a decent one, but we still hit. You hit a lot harder than I anticipated. We can stop whenever you'd like, Murgle. How dare you offer me such a weak alternative to ultimate victory for the Murgle Burgle clan? Okay, your choice. Okay. That was a bit annoying. Which is blinded, he can't see Smith. Stop being such a pussy. I'm doing my best. He's a giant fishman with gills and you're on dry land. You've got to have the upper hand in the cardio department. Okay, well, let's mend our wounds. Mergo uses swipe, um, magic, cure ailments, I guess. Is that what that is? An ailment? It means I can see. Yeah, I'm no longer blind. Yeah. Special. Pew! 
Pew, pew, pew. You're in for it now, Murgle. Okay. Apart, unless you heal yourself and just act like that never happened. He like I've just realised some of the some of the actual wording up top is quite funny as well. He likes it in and around his mouth. Thunderstruck! Murgle's paralysed and can't move. Ah, oh, poor Murgle. You were warned though, buddy. You were warned. Pew, pew, pew! I missed him. He was paralysed and I still missed him. Really? And now I'm blinded again. Special. Let's go magic then. He starts eating fish sticks. He likes them in and around his mouth. That's what he said. <laughs> fish. Is, it, is that a South Park reference? Like the Kanye West South Park. Magic mend wounds. Okay. Um, magic water. This attack is wacky, yo. Ooh, that first hit was a big one. So was that one. Pew, pew, pew. This isn't looking good. This isn't looking good even. Well, it is for me, said Dick Longschlong. Oh, come on. Pew. Pew. 73. We'll take it. Whack attack. Um, 72. Okay. Magic cure elements. <clears throat> Richard Blinding Spit. Seriously. Well, I'll just do that again. I sing my old Cherokee hymn. You ain't all that in a bag of potato chips. Okay. Magic water. God's sake, I wish you'd stop doing that. Richard is no longer blinded. But he is dead. That was a 
was close. Nearly dead though. Seven HP I had left. And he's blinded me again. God's sake. At least I hit him twice. I wish he'd stop bloody blinding me. He's more annoying than anything. Hundred is Oh no, let's get let's get healed. Thunderstruck Oh what a hit How can this be the almighty Mogul defeated? I tried to tell you but you didn't listen, Mogul. I didn't listen. I didn't listen. Right. But he's gone, so how do we get his fin? Oh, we've got Molotov cocktail now. Okay. That was that was sucking brutal. You monster. He left me no choice. Don't even talk to me right now. Pfft, fine. No problem. No, don't stop. I'm I'm lonely. You still have us, Grandpa. Shut up, Andrew. Nobody likes you. This is why you have a little dick. <laughs> I don't have a little dick, Grandpa. I measured. Oh, it's probably bigger than your stupid head. Your grandchildren suck, by the way. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. It's a matter of fact. Enjoy the next 30 years of your life after this adventure. The years are not kind to you. Good to know. I've got Mergle's fin. This should work nicely for patching up the hole in the boat. Ten experience points. And yes, why not save the game while we are here? Right, okay. So we should probably... On our way down, speak to all these people. So it turns out that my plan was foiled by that prissy little wannabe stripper. So what you gonna do? I'm going to murder her and take all her money off her. That is way more illegal than your original plan. Again, only if you get caught. You can't argue with that logic, Richard. He sounds like a very sane, rational and well-adjusted individual. You should probably just leave him be. Good idea. You received 10 experience points. Is there anything down here now? Or is it all... Oh, we've got the clown down here. Well, aren't you just the cutest thing I ever did see? Um, thank you. I really love your peaches. I want to shake your tree. I'm guessing that should be a song that I probably should hear. Not quite sure what you're referring to. Lovey dovey, lovey dovey, lovey dovey all the time. I'm flattered, but not really my thing. Who we baby, I'm sure. Show you a good time. I don't know it. I should I feel like I should know it. I'm gonna go ahead and pass. I feel like it's a song, but I don't know it, so Let's go and speak to this guy. Do you like my armour? Do you like my armour? Isn't it? Isn't that what don't say it? Let the man speak, Richard. Once is enough. But I paid him five bucks and a handy to shamelessly plug metal as... Oh, okay. Okay. He's doing it again. I know what you're trying to do. Stop it. Stop it right now. Fine. Just take your damn experience. That was another... He said it. That was another plug for metal as Fook. God damn it. Who else have we got to talk to? 
Amanda Patton, I still can't believe I won all of that money last night. I finally have enough to open my own strip club. People say dwarves can't be strippers, but I'm here to show them that dwarves are people too. That's the spirit. Call me when it opens. Yeah, same. Tell me where it is. Oh, do. I don't know what... My voice just broke then, I think. Man, of all the apples on this tree are rotten. Someone took all of the good ones too. I don't know who that was. Nothing to do with me. Wonder who that could have been. Why can't I catch a golden fish? I've tried every kind of bait I can think of. Have you tried worms? No, I haven't tried any of those yet. How about anchovies? Uh-uh. I haven't tried any of those either. What about some sort of jig or lure to entice the fish? Nope. So, what have you tried then? Well, I told you I tried everything I could think of. Which would be... Well, I couldn't really think of anything. Teach a man to fish and he'll eat for a lifetime. Tell a man to go on a duck and attempt to catch a non-existent goldfish and he'll starve to death because he's actually stupid in every sense of the word. There's my 10 experience points. Alright, so let's talk to... Captain, the man in house from his pipe and produced a large smoke of clear, cloud into the air. Cloud of smoke in the air. Ah, the smell of open split sea and smoke. That's my best pirate accent, by the way. Let's fix this boat up. I approached the boat and made sure to... I approached the boat and made sure to smash the mushy fin of Murgle, the innocent creature I had to just brutally murder into the hole to patch it up nicely. Really, man? Did you have to put it that way? Just telling it how it is. Well, it looks to be patched up. I guess I should get going. I'll head to the east and look for the forest. Yeah, you do that before you murder any more innocent creatures. Yep. Off the coast of who the fuck cares. After travelling for what seemed like days. That was like literally 20 minutes. And I don't know what you're talking about when you said the boat was shitty because that ride wasn't at all bad. Well, I mean, there was no air conditioning. No air conditioning. It's a sucking rowboat. What did you expect? Hey! Hey what? Just hey! Uh-huh. Can we get moving, please? If I recall correctly, the forest was to the north. 